three children were taken to hospital after a fire broke out in a Red Hill flat on Monday morning. The Singapore Civil Defence Force SCDF said in a Facebook post that it was alerted to the fire in a unit at Block 71 Red Hill Road at about 7.20 a.m. Upon arrival, residents alerted firefighters that there were occupants trapped inside the smoke lock unit on the seventh floor. Firefighters from Alexandra Fire Station and Marina Bay Fire Station forced their way into the unit by breaking the padlock of the metal gate. The fire, which was located at the corner of the living room, was extinguished by SCDF officers with several buckets of water. While the fire was being extinguished, another team of firefighters that were searching the premises found three children inside the toilet at the back of the kitchen. The children were carried out from the unit by the firefighters and assessed by an ambulance crew, said SCDF. The children were taken to KK Women's and Children's Hospital for smoke inhalation. Two persons from the unit managed to escape through a bedroom window before the SCDF arrived. They were assessed for smoke inhalation but declined to be taken to the hospital. In the midst of SCDF's operation, five cats were also brought out of the affected unit, said the SCDF. As a precautionary measure, about 25 people from neighboring units were also evacuated by the SCDF and the police. Preliminary investigation indicates that the fire had likely originated from the batteries of two personal mobility devices PMD that were charging in the living room, said the SCDF. The SCDF reminded the public to take steps to prevent PMD fires. This includes not leaving charging devices unattended for an extended period of time or overnight and not to buy or use non-original batteries. Fires involving active mobility devices, including PMDs and e-bikes, saw a 33.3% drop from 63 cases in 2021 to 42 in 2022, according to SCDF's annual statistics report for 2022 released in February. At the time, SCDF attributed the decrease to the implementation of regulatory measures. But, it also said that such fires continue to be a concern for the authorities, as the devices involved are often used by those with walking difficulties.